Hello everyone, today we're going to take a look at Zeus, as you can see, making Bitcoin to Solana seamless. Zeus Network was also the winner of the initial vote on Jupiter. Probably the voters will receive some airdrop from, from Zeus. And if you are someone who has uh, participated in the voting here, you really want to take a look at, uh, at this one. We're very early here. The project is uh, quite hot. I'll leave a link in the description towards all links related to Zeus Network. On a quick note, I want to mention they also have a Zilli campaign, which you really want to go and do some social activities. Activities. But besides all that, the DAP which we're going to take a look today is called Apollo because their testnet is live and you can participate in and make some testnet activities to earn additional a portion of Zeus airdrop. So in this video, we're going to go over the steps so we can secure some of the Zeus network airdrop. My name is Tradertix. In this channel, I talk about crypto. As always, if you like the content, make sure to subscribe and let's jump into the tutorial. First step, of course, go follow Apollo on, uh, on X and also go follow a Zeus on X. I'll leave all the links in the description, as I said. And then we're going to go to the Apple DAP. And here we are very, very early, as I said, and there is only two things which you can currently do here. But if you decide to farm this, you have to put it in your weekly rotation and come back to this website once or twice a week and perform uh, uh, testnet activities. So what I usually recommend for, for websites where you have to use faucet on daily basis, because here you can use the faucet uh, every 24 hours, is that uh, you you should be using the faucet every, every day or every second day, so you can generate uh, test BTC and then once a week or twice a week you can you know provide whatever but the faucet is something you you, you should spam now currently what I want to say here is uh, that I had some trouble I tried with three wallets to use the faucet and I managed to get some test BTC on the third wallet so it, currently it's overloaded and you have to try a few times probably to uh, to get the initial test BTC and after that you will proceed with the wallet which you managed to obtain uh, test, test BTC of obviously. So what you have to do here is connect your wallet and then press claim and just wait. And if you manage to claim, it's going to, first it's going to go through the capture and then in the bottom right corner, it's going to tell me that I have already used the faucet and I can use it in 24 hours. Uh, the other message which you can get is just an error message and, and that message is going to tell you that the faucet is overloaded and you have to uh, try again. And on the second time, usually it's going to tell you that you have used, you have made your 24 hour attempt with this wallet. So I see this as a testnet bug because uh, using the first time is going to tell you that it's um, overloaded, the error, but it's going to record uh, your four, uh, 24 hour cooldown. So pretty much your wallet is, is done for the day, despite the fact that you haven't received the testnet. So that's a little bit kind of annoying, but it is what it is. As I said, I have tried with three wallets and I, I managed to uh, obtain the TBTC on the third wallet. Then once you obtain your test BTC, you go to provide and then uh, you're going to deposit. So I'm going to deposit here, fetching TX ID. And despite that, you cannot really do anything else here yet. But as I said, we're very early. Uh, once withdrawals are available, uh, I would recommend that you um, withdraw some portion, do a claim. You, there will be a, a borrowing section. You have we have to participate in that as well. So this video kind of aims to tell you about Apollo and Zeus network, and in the future they'll unlock functionalities. And if you decide to farm this airdrop, you have to record all kinds of uh, different testnet transactions. So everything they unlock and you see available on the website in the near future, you have to use it and record transactions. The name of the game when it comes to testnet activity is always spam transactions. So our deposit is done here and we're pretty much done with the testnet. Now to interact with this app, I don't think I told you, but we are using Phantom Wallet. Uh, so if you have some test BTC on other, you know, if you have participated in other test networks, uh, farming, uh, BTC related uh, chains, etc., you might have 
a test bit so you can transfer from your other wallet if you are really struggling with the claim for set here also what else i recommend is join the, at least the zeus network discord um, i have missed i have unfortunately i have missed airdrops in the past for which i qualify except having a role inside the discord of the particular project so that's something you really want to join, you know, uh, follow their X account and join the, the Discord and obtain the basic role there. Currently, I don't see Apollo having Discord, but if they make one, they will probably make a false set inside the Discord as, as well. So you, you can maybe keep an eye for that as well. So for now, that's it. The word is out, especially if you have participated in the first round of voting because uh, Zeus Network did, did want this one. So yeah, thanks for watching this one and I'll see you all with the, with the next one. If you have any questions, use the comment section below and yeah, Discord soon guys, Discord soon. I really need the Discord so I can put more information out because there is so much going, going on right now. Airdrops left and right, claims, etc, etc. So, so all that information will be posted in, in the new Discord once it's, it's live. Stay tuned. See you all with the next one.